So this is the event editor, but uh, it looks quite a lot like the uh, Fusion 2.5 event editor. Um, it's got a dark theme here, but it uh, it works like you're used to. The thing here is that um, the expression editor is going to change quite a bit. Um, what you see here looks right now like the old event editor. I mean, expression editor, sorry. Um, but if you have several um, parameters to your action, for example, it's going to list them one by one on the same screen. So you're not no longer required to step through all your parameters one by one just to edit one of them. One of the things that we're working on right now is to, to really make it easy to, to do stuff. Um, for that, we're really trying to reduce mouse clicks for one, but we're... For example, if you make a lot of actions in one place, let's say... If you want to edit all, all of these, some people might want to go to the uh, action list editor, sorry, event list editor. What we have done in Fusion 3 is remove that. Um, not entirely, because you can still access it by clicking the event number here. Plop. And you get all your, all your actions and you can reorder them. And just click again and you're done. So no longer you have to go to a completely separate editor to, to, um, to change your things and, and get a, a better view over what order your actions have. Um, going to show a few things. Um, here we haven't quite gotten to the part where you can, uh, through an, uh, a nice interface, enter the, the key number that you want to press. For now I would just enter 32 which corresponds to a space. What we're going to do is to make it possible to like press the space key and it will know which key it is. But for every parameter in every action, we really want to, you to be able to use the expression as editor. So if you're not happy with hard coding the key you're going to press, you can always just revert back to the expression editor for that parameter and get the key you want to press from some other data source, an alterable value, uh, a configuration file. Um, and it will just work. Can you be able to show IntelliSense? Yes. Um, what we're going to do with the expression editor as well is to make it um, much easier to to write stuff 